Right. I was thinking, I was, like, when we were talking, when you mentioned Isekai like, Quartet earlier, I was like, I know I'm missing one show, but what is it? <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. And I've, I've always seen, like, the first, I've only seen the first season a good amount of season two, but it's just, like, the first season definitely got me, like, interested. Especially since the main character in Dub is voiced by uh, Cooler from Dragon Ball Z and Bridge. Okay, so, so I, <laughs> uh, uh, one thing, I'm gonna, uh, take, uh, give the, uh, the, um, the mic to Scrappy in a second here, but like one thing, uh, before I do that, one thing I will s say about this star in particular is that uh, what makes this one difficult is that um, you need to pretty much go through most of the level with the cloud flower, and you only get the cloud in this on like on this be beginning section. No hit run. Yeah, so basically don't touch checkpoints because you're gonna screw yourself over if you do that. Um, do you need a do you need a floaty jump or? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna, I I would like to keep clouds if I can help it. But um, you but primarily you need a floaty jump, right? Yeah. So if I can, can I even get? Okay. Um, how long have we? How long have we been talking? By the way. I don't know. Not um, long enough. A little God while. damn it. Um, but yeah, I was, I was gonna say like, good. I was gonna say good. Anime saves us again. <laughs> yeah, right. Anime was not <laughs> a mistake. <laughs> Anime is real. Take take that, Undyne. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, but I was gonna I was gonna take uh, give the floor to Scrappy because I, I he I, I want I want to know what you have to say about uh, crap. Uh, what you have to say about um, uh, Isekais? No, you don't. <laughs> okay, now I definitely do. <laughs> okay, well um. I just, like well, I got like, since we since we are still on the topic of Isek of isekai animes, I was gonna like um I was gonna brief I was gonna briefly talk about Inuyasha because you know that's an old one. Oh, oh is that uh, is that considered isekai as well? It's isekai. Yeah, I mean, let me like it's a beautiful pan and all that. Yeah, because I mean, like because like Kagome just keep Kagome keeps going back and forth between the, between worlds. But I guess, right. like in all in all cases, it is considered an isekai. Definitely, it's definitely like one of the earliest animes from my like, youth that I remember watching. Right. But I mean, but like, I, I, I like. Well, and, and, well, I watch like, it all. The, I watch that shit all the time back on back on like Adult Swim and all that. Like I never yeah, watched. Like, I never watched in Inuyasha myself. Damn it. Uh, Inuyasha myself, but like I, I vaguely remember it being like the talk of the town for a while. Definitely popular in his day. Yeah. yeah. I, it, I believe the creator is the same one who made Rama one half. <laughs> yeah, I'm person. pretty sure it is. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. But I, I'm curious now. Do you have like uh, an, <laughs> a vendetta against uh, Isekai's or something scrappy? <laughs> when they're done poorly, yes. Do you have like a? Do you have like one you actually oh like right now? Face Jam. <laughs> 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 you're not wrong. Uh, yeah, 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 that is. <laughs> Which one? The first one or the second one? <laughs> I haven't seen the second one yet, so I have to say the first one. Second one, okay. Because yeah, you're technically not wrong. Space Jam is an isekai. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. God. <laughs> uh. Oh, oh yeah, um, but yeah, like, do, I'm not being serious about the one you like. <laughs> but I mean, like the the, the the other one that I definitely wanted to mention that we that that Jason we actually need that we should get back to at some point is what Welcome to Demon School Year. Oh right, 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 right. Right, I remember yeah. you guys were watching that. Yeah, yeah. that one. Yeah, that, that was actually that was actually really good. Yeah. So I was watching it on my own, and then uh, we learned that oh, we can just watch. I can watch it with Xavier. I should stop. I should really just find time to watch animes by myself again. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, there, it's like I yeah. tried to watch too many things with too many people. Yeah, there, there's definitely yeah. that's, that's why I I like to um like there, there's like the shows I watch with um with other people, and then there's just the stuff I watch on my own time. Like it's it's nice to just have like your just casual you time every now and then. Yeah, I can't remember the I can't remember the last time I really watched an anime myself. I mean, like I'm going through Futurama with Hub, but that's only because he's never seen the show at all. And I want, and I need an excuse to watch the series again after so many years. Yeah. Right. 
You're in one of the goaded episodes too. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, not like not 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 like not 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 to not to mention not to mention he's up. We're we're going through JoJo's bizarre adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you need a cloud. Dang it. Ah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try. Uh, it. So I'm, so I'm gonna see if I can do some MLG strats uh, real quick. We're gonna try. Oh, oh, I'm gonna. Oh, that's not good enough. Nah. Damn it. Bye. Wow. Uh, if maybe, maybe if you were Luigi, you could barely make it? Eh, uh, that seems even too too high for that. Yeah. Because, like, Luigi jumps higher, but he doesn't jump that much higher. So, this yeah. is actually going to be one of the hard ones. Yeah, this is actually, like, yeah, this is one of the more difficult ones. So from what I can tell, you just gotta once once you turn on the uh, once you turn on the switch, you gotta like uh, just get go back flower. to It seems like you at least need one. I don't know if you need two. I probably oh. play it safe though, if you can help it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, what are we talking about? East um, Yeah, East Academies. Yeah, we were talking about Demon School, and then it just d evolved into us having our own time to watch it by ourselves, watch anime by ourselves. Right. Uh, that, I guess that's a question. Um, like, well, I mean, I know Jason can't answer, but damn it. <laughs> okay. Well, hopefully this is the this is the good run. Uh, what have you guys been watching anything by yourselves lately? Um. I mean, like, well, not, not well, not, not really an anime. I mean, like, I guess, it, I guess it still kind of could be kind of count in in the whole isekai genre. But I've been watching Gargoyles. <laughs> oh, nice. What you've been watching on Disney Plus? Yeah, I've been watching Gargoyles. Oh God. Okay. Really good. Re really, really, really good show. And hope really good show, by the way. Because mm. like, right, I definitely remember. Three, you still have all three clouds. Yeah, as long as Cause I. Because I, I, because I, I, like, I, because I do remember watching. Watching it when I was younger. I mean, I, I know, I know, my dad would. I know my dad watched it all the time. Mm. But like, you know, like, like this is one of like a few. This is like um, one of a few times where like I'm, I, I'm actually just like watching it by myself, and I'm on, I'm like halfway through season two now. Nice. All right, we should get this. Okay, cool. Oh right, yeah. Okay, so yeah, you only needed one. All right. Oh boy, that was hard for Mario. See, I'm not doing my Mario voice anymore. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that. Was... Then I guess it's up to me to step over. No, I mean, you're retired too. Oh. Come on, me. Well, we managed to bullshit our way from for a good portion of that. <laughs> yeah. Talk more about anime, because apparently we can use that to. <laughs> drag out the the conversation. Although actually, uh, no, actually, I got something. That, well, not about anime, but like when, like, uh, when I mentioned the whole bit where I was like, "Oh, I can't like really do like watch things by myself anymore." Right. <laughs> it just reminds me how li how little I play games by myself now. Like for me, I just ha for me like lately, it just has to be a stream. Like I'm surprised. Yeah. Like I'm surprised I'm even playing Resident Evil Chronicles Three on my own right now. <laughs> Uh, I I tend to have to have a um, like noise in the background when I play games. Like, like if I don't, if I'm not in a call or I'm not, I, I don't have a video or a stream on. Usually, like some kind of podcast type video. Um, I something something just doesn't feel right. Like, I, I like I, I guess it feels too lonely. I don't know. Yeah, but, well, I mean, like part of the reason why I do the stream is like I guess it's the reason just to play. Right. Like the except like, why, that's why I'm even going through the Jack games right now. Right. Um. Like I have, like, I have my. Part of, cool. like, part of it also is, is a reason for me to eventually get the Jack, the Jack X because I've never touched it. Same. Uh. Will he? Will he get the star? Nope. No. <laughs> Damn it. Oh. 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 Yes. Yeah. 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 Oh. Also. 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 Another news: the the next N sixty four game for the Switch Online has got got announced. Oh, cool. But don't tell me. I want to see. Oh, I was, all right. Uh, okay. I was, yeah, I was just gonna say like, what is the game? All right. Let me see. So I'm uh, going to YouTube right now. Yeah. It'll probably be on like one of the top of my things. 
Okay, let's see. Maybe. Uh, yes. Okay. Okay. That that hitbox is larger than it looks. Hello. Hi. Was that, was that Scrappy? Someone die. I died. Oh, it augments. Oh, oh, there it is. Yeah. Um, it, it it's a psych bike. Oh, yep. cool. Yeah. Um, it'll be playable on the thirtieth. Mario Party Three. Where's Banjo Tooie? <laughs> Where's DK Sixty Four? Said, yeah, well, they never said they Harry. Promised, they promised uh, Mario Party Three in the thing. Yeah. 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 I mean, I, I I don't I don't really like DK Sixty Four, but you you gotta have the funny monkey game on there. Yeah. Diddy Kong Racing will come eventually, Harry. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm, I'm, well, that that too, but. Hey, come on, Reggie, give us Mother Free. How about I give you this <laughs> instead? <laughs> you know, yeah, like I, I so, sometimes I like when like the P, my PC is still booting up and stuff. Like I sometimes just have like random like boot up like random like uh, casual games that I can just play in like a few minutes or so. Like I I have a random habit of like just randomly doing the challenges in Rayman Legends sometimes, <laughs> just because they they <laughs> like they they there's something quick I can, I can do while the stuff stuff boots up. <laughs> I, well, I I I honestly I've never I've never played Excite Bike 64, so this should be interesting. Me neither. I I I don't think I've ever seen it. I've only seen the original Excite Bike. Like, I, 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 I I I think like I think like like I I definitely remember seeing seeing it like at at like yeah. a McDonald's and like a McDonald's thing back 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 when McDonald's had like those N64 play play things. But I, I think those. but that's about it. Mm -hmm. I didn't know Excite Bike 64 existed until. I did cool. not know Excite Bike 64 existed until 2018, I think. Damn. I'll be honest. I didn't know. I didn't know it was a thing until just now. Damn. I I know uh, Excite. Was it Excite Truck? Is one a thing on the Wii? Yeah. Oh, there it is. Um. And it's. I'll go look at that. I I I think that one's like pretty popular. Excite truck. Um, yeah, but, uh, I, 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 I definitely do know. First try. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, like you definitely have to get this one up because 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 you can see Mario's animation where the part where like he's flying too off, yeah. far off into the abyss. Yeah, you, you're like you're like a few inches off from death. Yeah, but yeah, like but yeah, like I I definitely I definitely like I definitely knew about I heard about Excite Bike sixty four. Didn't really play it. Heard about Excite Truck, never played that either. I know the main theme for that game got ported to Smash Bros. for some reason. Um, really? Huh. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, the main, yeah, the main theme oh. from Excite Truck is in Smash. That's hilarious. Yeah, I mean, um... It's no different than Excite by getting, like, an NES, getting a present, like, presents in an NES medley. It's just... Right. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. I mean, actually, I, oh, yeah. I guess you, you, kind of ex you kind of expect, like, Excite Bike to be in an NES medley. Yeah, because especially since when, it's one of the it, it's, it's like, one of the early games. It's one of the most like iconic things you think of. Yeah, um, Not for me. <laughs> oh yeah, um, yeah. There, there was there, like there was Excite Bot Trick Racing. I would always see that when I saw a gameplay event. Thought that, but never never got a chance to play Excite Bot. But that one looks, but that one actually looks really fun to play. I've never heard of that. I think I don't. Yeah, think, yeah I don't think I've heard of that one. Yeah, but like aside from that, like like the the only other Excite Bike related game that I played was Excite Bike World Rally, which was a WiiWare game. It's which it's 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 a WiiWare which is a WiiWare game because like it's based it base it's basically like it's basically like a reimagining of the NES game, but obviously with newer mechanics and stuff. Hmm. And it's and it's actually and it's and it's and it's really good. It's too bad you can't play it anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, too bad you can't play it anymore. You can't, you can't, you, yeah, you can't get it. Yeah, too bad you can't get it anymore. Nice. Cause I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm surprised Nintendo never brought that game back in any capacity. Mm. Uh, well, at, yeah, at we least could. we'll, at, at least we'll always have Excite Bike Arena and Mario Kart, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <I get it. laughs> so how yeah, many... you know, yeah. You knew I, you knew I was gonna bring that up eventually. I know. I remember. I remember one time we were playing a session. I'm like, "Fuck it," uh, and I was the one who picked it for you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because we gotta get it out of the way. Every session we gotta play Excite Bike Arena at least once. 
I I I, I mean I do. Salty there in that run. I mean I I do like I do like that track, but like after a point, like I I kind of get sick of it. But yeah, the layouts, right. are, but the layouts, not the layouts are different each time, guys. I swear, it's just not the same track. Okay. <laughs> I mean that that does I, I do like that aspect of it to be fair. Yeah. Um Yeah. Yeah be like how how many like franchises ha has like Nintendo not done something with like in years? Like not yeah. ca not counting uh yeah, re worse. Wait, like, how did it worse if they just referenced it but never use it? <laughs> yeah. Like, not, oh, yeah, like, not, not, not counting like, like re-releases. Re <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, not, not, not counting like, um, like, re-releases or like, uh, mm. stuff on like, your virtual console or whatever. Yeah, that is... Hmm. Talk. I don't know. I don't oh, God. know. Well, I mean, how long do you consider the arbit- How long does it have to be for a franchise considered dormant? Uh, maybe like 10 years. Okay, the Excite Series F Zero with Wave Race, Golden Sun, Sin and Punishment. God. Yeah, Family right. Detective Club. Uh, if okay, you okay, remakes. to be fair, okay, I, I think I want to give, um, uh, go uh, you, you said Golden Eye, right? Golden Sun. Golden Sun. Oh, if you said Golden Eye, I was going to be like, okay, to be fair, the re release being on the Switch is actually a big deal. Right. I guess, yeah, um,. Well because yeah. like cause, because it's, it's also it's also the only licensed ga game on the NSO. exactly i i'll, I'll give um i I'll, I'll i'll say like famicom detective club is like like not so much in the, in the in this category because like it's a more of a was it wasn't it like more of a full on remake rather than like a port yeah it was a, it was a remake cuz like right. yeah cuz famicom detective club got remade i like, still i still those games yeah. Okay, if we're counting remakes as new stuff, you know, fair enough. Um, yeah. Star Tropics, if Nintendo even remembers the yeah. own that. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right, Star Tropics. Oh, yeah, wasn't well, well, Star Tropics also released on the um, NSO? Yeah, Star Tropics was. Don't you need, like, a manual or something to play that properly? Um, you need you, you, you need a manual to decode a message. Oh. But since the NSO doesn't have that, Better look up a guide. Nice. Because <laughs> yeah, because yeah, yeah, even like the Wii and Wii U Virtual Console releases of Star Tropics had that. Wow. <laughs> uh, pun Punch House getting there as well. That's been. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Punch Out. Um, been like what, thirteen years? Yeah. Fourteen um, going on fifteen, depending on how you count things. God. What do you mean? Uh, what else? Um. Oh, this one's gonna be a pain in the ass, isn't it? Oh right, you have to like, yeah. Um, what is it? You, you, to, like, you, made, you, you got you, you essentially have to blind jump, blind your way, blind jump this, don't you? I think so. Oh, oh you, um, you, 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 you just kind of roll uh, into it. Uh, um, there's legendary Starfies, and there's legendary Starfy because that there hasn't been a new Starfy game in years. Hmm. True. If we're just kind of like sub series, then well, Warrior Land has been dormant longer than the Warrior Land games were active. Yeah, I want a new Warrior Land game. Oh yeah, yeah, new Warrior Land. I forgot. Um, I wear it. Oh god. Well, I mean, I'm not uh, one grabbing Star Bits still. I don't think he wants. He wants to. It just feels good. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. There it, there it is. is. Oh yeah, you're gonna have to like... blind this for the most part. Yeah. Oh. F. Or feel it out. Um, would like would you say that Puzzle League also it would would be considered dormant at this point? Well, that's also uh, that's like, also are, like. Are, um... you, are you talking paneled upon? Yeah, paneled like, upon. Yeah, that that's like, mean, like. Yeah, that that would be like this like. Anything to do with panel to pawn or like um I mean like as yeah. far as I know like the, mo the most the, the, the most recent ver the most recent thing panel to pawn has been in was there was like there, there was like a version of it included in Animal Crossing New Leaf. 
<laughs> what, did, what, what did the amiibo want to take? Why do you not jump? The pod, like, that... cause, yeah, as, Cause as far as I'm concerned, that's the most recent iteration of Panel to Pond in anything. Mm. And that was added in 2016, so technically it's still quote-unquote active. Yeah. What was the last... Uh, I, I, okay, so I, I assume Pac-Man World Remake was the last uh, Pac-Man thing that was... Uh, like, new Pac-Man thing that was released. What was, the, what was yeah. before that? Um... um one can copy it then. Re-releases. Yeah, yeah, Ghost, yeah, yeah, I'd say like Ghost, Ghost, the Ghost of the Adventures 2. That sounds are you about counting, right. Are you, are you just talking about the platformers or just Pac-Man games in general? Pac-Man games in general. There have been Damn stuff it. like Pac- There was something released for the 30, the 35th anniversary in 2015, I think. I thought you were going to say something oh. got released for the 32 X. like what? <laughs> Like remember, like like yeah, you 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 you, you, remember, you remember that what you remember when there was a playable Google Doodle of Pac-Man that was really good. Uh, spe oh, speaking of Google, do you guys know about the uh, the thing where like if you, I think if you type in Katamari Damacy, like it, you can just kind of play with the ball thing and have it like build up like a bunch of stuff on the Google page. <laughs> it's really cool. You know, let me check. Let me let me actually check. Yeah, yeah, you can. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> All right. Damn it! How do I angle that? Nintendo IPs have stayed. Something made it to at least two games that didn't get anything basically for ten plus years. Of. Unrelated. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, I was gonna say something unrelated, but you were kind of, I like you're still talking, so go ahead. <laughs> just some of the sub, I guess, sub brands of Wii Sports, I guess, but. Oh, yeah, mm. No, 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 Harry's just building up his lies, and <laughs> that's more important than we realize. <laughs> that's why it's. Yeah, okay, got it. There we go. Nice. That is one good reason to get the star bit still. That is true. Now, I will say this, That's like, because uh, I'm never going to get the chance to say this again. Um, but I think, I, I do like Melty Monster, but I think I'm go I, I'm honestly going to say I prefer Melty Molten from the first game, because I feel like um, they do more of the lava gimmick, and I feel like it, I, Melty Molten in the first game just, like, it, it gives you the most, like, difficult platforming, like, at that point in the game, because it's the last major level, and... I don't know, I, I just, I think the level design in that is just more interesting than Melty Monster. Okay. End of discussion. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, okay, at least the first green star is right there. So anyways, what I was saying earlier is like, because I, I stopped paying attention for a good while. So. <laughs> right. But So I was just like, for some reason, a bunch of random Japanese music videos showed up on my feed on YouTube. Good. And like some of them like make no sense. <laughs> <laughs> There's some weird. The current one that comes to mind is actually the one that's really opening to Ain't the Spy X Family. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Have you seen that music video before? <laughs> no. I barely seen anything. <laughs> I barely seen anything of the Spy X Family. Oh no! Okay, the, the music video is it's like it like it kind of like starts off as like a weird like. Uh, it feels almost like a haunted house kind of bit while it's playing this very cheerful song. <laughs> Actually, I feel like you might have shown me this before. The song? Like, maybe. Uh, well, maybe it's a music video. You, you might have just shown. I think you might have just shown me the opening or something. I, it was probably just the opening. If you turn the music videos, if I had to show you anything, it would probably be the first one of Kobayashi. Mm -hmm. I, I love Actually, how wait. I, no, 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 never mind. <laughs> I think it's something dumb. <laughs> no, I was gonna say, I, I just love how the first Dragon Maid OP is just drugs. Like, what is, I mean, the, what is going on? My I mean, it's a great song. <laughs> I will be right back. Oh, I think one of my favorite parts about I still think one of my favorite bits is in season two when, when Toby is doing um, laundry. She has the TV on, it's literally doing the music video. <laughs> the, yeah. To the first opening, although it's animated, obviously. 
<laughs> no, I, like, I, 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 I think at one point Tori started singing the song while drunk. <laughs> no, I, I've seen stuff like that before, where like they they put the actual the OP in the in the show itself or something like that. Like it's oh, it's not even just the OP. It it, it was legitimately the music video. <laughs> like, they like they were doing the exact same dance routine. <laughs> Uh, you know what that rem that reminds me of like freaking Shadow the Hedgehog of all things, <laughs> where like Eggman's just, Egg where, where Eggman's literally just watching the uh the, the opening to the game. Oh. <laughs> oh crap. Oh, you're right. During the oh yeah, during during that weirdly during the weird during the cutscene that for some reason uh re red in CG. <laughs> yeah. There's a there's a few CG cutscenes in the game. Yeah, I mean like the good like, those are the best ones. Yeah. Like the intro cutscene for one thing. Yeah, I, I not, not yeah. a very opening. I'm, I'm talking about like when the aliens start invading. Oh well, that too. But I was, I was gonna say like I know it's like ridiculously edgy and over the top, but like I can't help but love the shadow like opening cinematic. Like it, it's like. Sonic dies. <laughs> I I just like the. Oh, there it is. Oh, it doesn't look hard to get at all. Oh, yeah, you just got up here. Um. Yeah. No, I I I just love its style. Like, <laughs> it's just really well done. I'm falling down with the gun. <laughs> oh yeah. God. Uh... <laughs> What's the scrappy uh... address? I. <laughs> I'm a very pleasant presence in this play let's play. I mean, feel free to jump in whenever. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you guys are on a roll. I don't have <laughs> much to say about Isekai. I mean, it doesn't, right. it doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be about Isekai. Just anything. We're we're trying our best to keep things like going with this. I mean, we've you been know, doing okay so, so No, I'm not this. Mm. What did you say, Jason? We've been doing okay so far. Yeah, right. Just so people... Honestly, let me circle back to Isekai just for a moment, just so people think I'm not dismissing a whole genre out of hand. <laughs> As with any genre, you will have your good and you will have your bad, since it is kind of... I guess the predominant... is or was a predominant genre among, I guess, a specific sector of anime for some time. Yes, yeah, so you're gonna have a higher quantity of stuff, which means it's gonna be a higher quantity of bad stuff. I was gonna say that it is, is pretty oversaturated. I was gonna say, to be fair, it is pretty oversaturated in like, yeah. the past few years. Yeah, yeah, it's I like a... there's been a lot of isekais over the past few years, so like there's gonna be a lot of uh, trash you're gonna have to dig through. I had a friend years ago liken the influx of isekai to Hanna Barbera's output. Hmm. Lots of derivative stuff. <laughs> yeah, that checks out. So, you know, I'm just oh. you know, quoting my friends here. Kirito and Scrappy Doo are basically the same character. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Uh, please, I, I, I kind of want some further elaboration on this one. <laughs> what? <laughs> please elaborate further. I, I'm curious where this is going. I, did, I didn't come, I didn't coin this. It was a friend who who said this. They didn't really elaborate either. Oh, this is a, imagine someone going up, up on stage and just being like, Scrappy Doo and uh, Kirito are the same character, and then they just leave, like refuse to elaborate, leaves. You know that the way you say that, you know, what reminds me. Of? It reminds me of one of my very favorite bits from uh, America's Got Talent, right? Oh yeah. There, this guy just walks up on stage and starts playing tequila. But he does. But he says. No, but he's doing karaoke or something. <laughs> but yeah. you know. But the, but you know the joke is he doesn't. He doesn't do anything until until, uh, until it says tequila. <laughs> <laughs> so he just goes. Da -da 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 he just sits there. <laughs> <laughs> and then like what? What? Da -da 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 tequila. And that's it. <laughs> I, I can just uh I, I can just imagine like Simon Cow just l looking at him, just be like, "All right, wh when are you gonna do something?" No, he he said it was so stupid. I loved it. <laughs> <laughs> oh crap! <laughs> nice. 
This pose is right, If we're gonna, like, that was... <laughs> the scrappy do Kirito thing was probably just a shit pose, but... Probably. Let me try and probably analyze like that. that. Let me try to analyze that. <laughs> okay, go for they it. They both are or were the faces of a specific, very saturated genre in their respective decades. Mm. What was Scrappy's genre? The whole cave mystery, thing, probably? Mystery, mystery solving. Like, all those Scooby-Doo clones Hanna-Barbera made in the 70s. It's not over here. Because uh, oh, that was a job, though. Was like, why don't we just hire up? So, well, I mean, I thought you were gonna- I thought it was gonna be sort of like, kid of, like, like uh, just like what it was like, oh, we need a new sidekick kind of things. I mean, that's a trend, oh. but it's not really a genre. Oh, yeah, right. didn't- then they made- they made fun of it in a Scooby-Doo thing, didn't they? It was like, we promised never to talk about them, or something. I mean, that's just majority of Scooby-Doo material since okay, 1999. I guess, I guess it's not over there. Wow, that's actually a I thought. Although I think one of my... You know, the funny thing about all the Scooby-Doo clones is, I think there was an episode of Mystery Incorporated, where, like, all of them were together. <laughs> mm -hmm. Scooby had fallen ill and just started dreaming that he had a team with Speed Buggy, Jaguar Jaw, Captain Caveman, and... Uh, the Funky Phantom. The one I didn't recognize. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but uh, like, that's just, like either, either way, that's a pretty funny idea. Yeah. Just like, we, uh, it's, it's like acknowledging all of the Hanna-Barbera-like uh, stuff. Hmm. Someone else. I think one of those same friends I mentioned earlier made another comment recently. Mm -hmm. Saying that Hanna Barbera and I guess the anime industry were not too different because they you know, specialize in just making very iconic characters, even if the shows aren't always good. Is like I guess so. Yeah. I mean that's yeah. one way to strike yeah. Kirito. <laughs> uh... Okay, is it? I mean everybody knows who I mean, I don't oh, care I who you are, everybody knows who Kir everybody knows who Kirito is. Yeah, yeah, I mean he's a freaking super boss and tells the abyss. No, tail, no, tails over, tails over, tails over, tails over, tails over, rise. Right. Well, yeah. to be fair, it's, a, it's also a, it's a DLC super boss. Right. But still, the, the fact that he's a super. Oh, yeah. Okay. You know what's funny about that? I uh, my sister is actually seeing a good amount of a show, right? Nice. Yeah. Like so apparently, <laughs> um, you know, you know a bit where I explained where where Asuna just just instant kills your party if you kill if you kill Kirito first. Yeah. <laughs> I showed her that, and she's like, oh yeah, oh yeah, that. Because <laughs> <laughs> apparently that's actually a thing she can do. Because it's like, apparently she's a goddess now or something. <laughs> in the sh in the show itself? Yes. I, it's probably, I... It's probably, it's probably the current stuff. God, I don't even remember that. That, that I mean, I would, knowing SAO, I... I can't say I'm too surprised, but what the hell? <laughs> what I will say the idea that Goddess Asuna. <laughs> Goddess Asuna. I will say that the idea that Asuna will literally ruin your life if you hurt Kirito is both canonical and also very funny. That is, I mean, oh, that that part, is actually oh, yeah, the best, the, the best yeah. part about that is um, uh, j she, just to make sure you stay dead, she even nukes your bench. <laughs> That is hilarious. I've never really seen a boss do that. <laughs> she hits the point. She hits the party members who can't get hurt. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's like they're they're just having like a picnic in the background and they just die. It's like oh. I guess I'm. I, I, I guess heard I, pick. I heard pick. I heard picnic and I went what? <laughs> Don't worry about it. No, it's like the, like the people that the characters like. In your in the like your party that aren't fighting, they're just chilling, having a picnic or something, and then they just then they just they're just suddenly dead. It's like, oh okay, I guess I, I guess I'll die. After after this, do you think how long we've been recording? Uh, it's been an hour fifteen. Uh, should we just should we just well, cause we we just been doing two hours per set per green stars, I think, wasn't it? Uh, I mean we we don't really have like a set time for these things. We kind of just go until we want to stop. Because, like, I actually have a few plans today. <laughs> mm -hmm. One of them is involved with Nick, who's waiting for me to ping him. <laughs> oh, I see. 
Uh, we'll just, we'll just do a few more of these, I guess. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. Uh, uh. And we're getting good chunks done at a time. Yeah. And besides, besides, we it might be good for us to to, to cut the call before we actually run out of steam. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I. I, I would like to not have too much uh, available before perfect. Well, I mean, like, if we can get, look, I mean, we're, built, we're missing only 20 more stars or so, right? Um. Because uh, this is like, I think this is like 218. I think. Because uh, that, I have uh, including, the, including the two stars in Grandmaster, it's a 242, right? Yeah. So yeah, we're almost done. We can probably get this yeah. done in one or two more in one more session. Yeah. yeah. Well, I was gonna say I was gonna say though I I would like not to have too many stars remaining uh, for next time because I don't know how long Grandmaster's gonna well, take. Well, obviously we don't. Well, we don't want Grand. Well, like. Well, okay. Here's the question: How confident do you feel you can beat Grandmaster? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here's a better question: Do you feel like you, it'll take less than an hour? I hope so. Well then, like, well then, because like in theory, we should, uh, we we probably should like try to get Grandma the, the next bit done in one in one session. Right. I mean, I guess what you can do is ask uh, Nick how long he's willing to wait. Yeah. Sure. And then after that, because after that, I also told Hub we we might do more Futurama later. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, it's right there? Huh. I saw the sparklies. I didn't even see that, probably because I was focused on DMing. Mm. 